Hey guys, so let's divide some numbers written in a binary notation. First question is how many times does 101 go into one? Zero times. How many times does 101 go into 11? Also zero times. How many times does 101 go into 110? Well, that's one time. So then we do one times 101 to give us 101, and then we subtract them. Well, we can't do zero minus one, so we're gonna borrow from here, and that's gonna make this a two, because in binary it's base two. 2 minus 1 gives us 1, and then 0 minus 0 gives us 0, and 1 minus 1 gives us 0. So now let's clean all this up, and let's bring down that 0. How many times does 1, 0, 1 go into 1, 0? That's 0 times. Let's bring down the next one. How many times does 1, 0, 1 go into 1, 0, 0? That's also 0 times. So let's bring down the next 0. How many times does 1, 0, 1 go into 1, 0, 0, 0? That's going to be 1 time. Then we multiply 1 times that and subtract them. So we can't do zero minus one and we can't borrow from these zeros. So we have to borrow from this one. That's gonna make the next term over a two. Then we can borrow from this two, make it a one and make this a two. And the same thing, we'll borrow from this two, make it a one and make this a two. Now we subtract two minus one, we get one. One minus zero, we get one. One minus one, we get zero. So we end up with zero, one, one. Now let's clean this up. Now let's bring down another one. How many times does 101 go into 111? It'll go in one time. So then we multiply one times 101 gives us 101, and then we're gonna subtract it. One minus one is zero. One minus zero is one. One minus one is zero. And now we can bring down the last one. How many times does 101 go into 101? That's exactly one time. And then we can multiply these and subtract, and we're left with a bunch of zeros. So 11000011 one, one, zero, 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 one, one, divided by 101 is equal to 100111. Zero, zero, one, one, one. And in decimal, that would be 195 divided by 5 equals 39. How exciting.